Pla Pla of Zimbabwe batting for a long, long time now. 206 matches for him. <laughs> and he gets off the mark straight away. And he's come at the right time. A left arm spinner in operation. And he's one of the best players of spin that you'll get in world cricket. Well, there's the big shot. That's going to go all the way. Indeed, first six of the morning. And it's come off the bat of Andy Flower. Great shot. There's no surprise seeing Andy Flower play the slog sweep against a spinner. He is very proficient at this shot. It's a big boundary he's attacking. Harari Sports Club is a big outfield. This is cleared by quite some margin. And deep square leg, who was in a position to catch it if it didn't have the length on the ball, knew straight away that was six and not going to be a catch. Certainly got hold of uh, that one. And there's a little more finesse introduced into his game. That will not run all the way to the boundary. But they will come back for three runs. Very, very well played. Andy Flower already on to 18. Progressions, well, Zimbabwe, if they go at the current rate, would get to near to 70 already. I'd be happy with that. We're at the halfway stage. Really no problems for the Zimbabweans as yet. <laughs> Using his feet again this time. He's hit it straight up. Not go all the way. But he will go for four. So I didn't quite get hold of that one. I think it came off the top edge, if anything. That's hit hard. It didn't go past the captain by too far. And it's gone past mid on with a lot of power. He was only placed about 10 yards away on the boundary. He could never get there. Wishart has been very, very strong with the bat this morning. He's hit the ball with a lot of power throughout the innings. There's a lot of timing in the shot as well. Andy Flower gone square through the offside. That's improvised as well. He's a magnificent player. Shot square of the wicket against Spin. He got himself into such a wonderful position there, Andy Flower. Picked his gap and played it superbly. Left hand on strike to the leg break bowler. Well, that's very short. That's going to be punished. Well, that's gone through for four. Uh, literally a long hop that uh, Andy Flower look, just had to help himself with. Moves on to 39. Delivery was very short. The bowler struggling as he comes into the attack. But it was well played by Andy Flower. Two men sweeping. One very much on square or just behind. One well in front of square. But he lifted it into the gap. To get power into that area of the field, not easy. a bit of a loop and he's out well second wicket for Zimbabwe to fall and it's Andy Flower huge wicket for the Namibians and they'll be celebrating that because uh, Andy Flower was in the process of putting a gem of an innings together great effort by JB Berger and he will enjoy this moment he's got an international wicket for the first time but also look at the scalp it's Andy Flower who's been very aggressive against him just coming too much inside the line of this one, getting an edge and well taken by the keeper. That's a good catch because it was very full. Andy Flower gone for 39, so Bobby 174 for two. 